the anticipation of what the new year brings and in preparation to shape and position to receive what God has designed for his people this year 2023, the Basilica of Greece Anglican Church Gudu Abuja embarked on a fasting and praying revival program. Members were prepared to take on the right attitude this year to be able to walk in God's provision. Chas Philip Uwakula reports. It's a week-long fasting and praying revival program and taking the Abuja Diocesan theme, which says divine exaltation. The Basilica of Grace Anglican Church, headquarters of the Gudu Archdeaconry in the Abuja Diocese, led by the Vika, where the members were prepared for the year through God's word and intentions for his people. I am standing by the The Vika believes there is no other way to begin the year. As a church, our own resolution is to entrust our lives and our activities to the hand of the Almighty God. Because nobody has gone through this year, but we believe as Christians that God has walked, walked through this year. And as God told us in the scriptures that the Lord knows the end from the beginning. He knows, and that's why this one week prayer and fasting was organized to seek the face of God before we launch out, to seek God and ask God for direction. And as a church, we have declared this year as a year of divine visitation. This country is full of tension, full of confusion, and all the rest. But the word of God that God is sending our way is this year is that we should not be afraid. Why? Because he's with us. In times of challenges, he will never leave us. You never forsake us. Some members who attended testified of the spiritual gratification. And as the program was tied to divine visitation, it was actually a time we felt God's presence you know, throughout the program. It was really interesting. I, I enjoyed myself. I heard God speak. And I feel that I've been equipped and energized to go through the year in the present with God. Uh, revival was so awesome. It started on Monday, concluded today during the service, which is still divine visitation. We treated so many topics, so it was really a time with the Lord. We're so filled. We learned that this year is a year that is under God, and that everything we do this year has to be ordained by God, and we should trust in Him. That's the message we have taken from the entire week. That everything I want to put my hands into this year, everything that is going to happen and everything that um, I've planned, I should just trust God that it's going to be according to His own plan. Charles Philip Wakolam, CNN News.